We all know about the cave on Dagobah in Star Wars The Empire Strikes Back that Luke Skywalker goes into where he faces a vision of Darth Vader, but what if I told you that years later his nephew Ben Solo aka Kylo Ren would destroy that same cave? In the Age of Resistance comic book, decades after Jedi Master Yoda trained Luke Skywalker on the swampy surface of Dagobah, Supreme Leader Snoke brought Kylo Ren to the planet as part of his own training in the dark side of the Force. Kylo is then ordered by Snoke to face whatever he encounters within the cave. Kylo is first approached by a vision of Luke who states that he does not want to fight, but the dark Dark Apprentice slays the apparition anyway. On the other hand, when visions of his parents, Han and Leia, appear before him, he can't bring himself to attack them. To hide his weaknesses from his master Snoke, Kylo destroys the revered cave. Snoke is pleased that his disciple can cause so much damage with the Force, but also complains that he can no longer train others at the crucial site that had existed for thousands of years. It's kind of a bummer that the cave is gone, but let me know what you think of this in the comments, and may the Force be with you.